Welcome back to Let's Play Penumbra Black Plague. When we last left off, we had just entered the library. Almost thought it was raining. This looks like a normal library almost, but uh, let's go ahead and use the save point real quick. Just in case. Seems like a good idea, typically. The turn gate. These belong to them. I feel less here. I'm slipping. Yes, because you keep touching alien artifacts. A whole section of detective novels. Oddly enough, it's a whole section of detective novels. De Vermis Mysteris. They've got a bunch of strange books here. Strange locking mechanism keeping the door shut. There must be a way to open it. Some well-thumbed linguistics books. Physics and maths. Ah, hang on. Oh, well, hello there. Mysterious door. Oh my oh, God! Good gracious. He's dead. Quick! If he hasn't started to smell, give him the kiss of life. Whoa! That startled the heck out of me. Investigate this room a bit. The uh, the music concerns me. Howard, father. I somehow knew it would end this way. Why did I come here? Oh, that explains the sad music. My condolences. Uh, lots of batteries. He was a well batteried individual. Turngate virus sentience conclusions. Howard Lefresque. Since leaving the last bastion of humanity in this place behind, it has become clear that my faith was well placed, my conclusions were correct, and it is only that which has brought me this far. It has taken me some time to make my way through the infected area of the shelter, and with the observations I have made, my prior discovery seems all the more obvious and vital. <sighs> Excuse me. The infected humans communicate with one another. Similarly, if simpler communication is observed in, in infected creatures of all species, if, shouldn't that have just been a similar or simpler? At times, the infected seem to coordinate well without clear line of sight, telepathy. Despite a catatonic appearance, the infected are quite capable of high-level brain function. Their problem-solving abilities at times seems to out, far outstrip those of a healthy human being. When separated, the creatures lose this intelligence, indicating some form of communal or central intelligence. Conclusion: The intelligence displayed is of such a level that we can only assume the communal mind is also rational. It is this conclusion that has formed the backbone of my recent endeavors. Though the infected may wander around like mindless, for want of a better word, zombies, they are no more stupid than a worker bee. Automatons, yes, but far from stupid. In short, I believe the central intelligence might somehow be communicated with, bargained with. Communication, however, is most likely impossible once affected, infected, unless there is a way to subdue the infection for long enough to contact the hive. There must be a way to find peace. Today, I communed with the Turngate mind. I was correct. It is intelligent beyond our wildest imaginations. It told me everything, everything I needed to know. You could not imagine it. I cannot accept it. God forgive us. Oh, diddums! Daddy popped his clogs. Bull bleeding who? Get on with it, will ya? This is one room I shall not desecrate by throwing random items everywhere. Although I will push this button. And Clarence, you be careful, or I'll off us both. I barely even thought about my father's death. I guess I wasn't expecting to find him any other way, but I was determined to complete his work, find an answer to the infection, and then contact this hive. Oh, 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 okay, we're in a cave now. Oh, that's nice. Nice change of scenery. Okay, there is apparently a whale somewhere. More wall whales, just what I needed. Thought we'd seen the last of the- Whoa! <laughs> Slight graphics, uh, graphics error there. Uh, that is a pixel shader error. The, uh, the shader 
for the lighting is acting up and instead of rendering as a transparent surface it turns the surface black. The reason I know that years past I had to play a lot of games on a computer that did not have a pixel shader compatible graphics cards and I got to observe many games and their interactions with the inability to render pixel shaders. I also used a program that allowed me to bypass pixel shaders completely which while making many games functional also led to graphical anomalies. Um, for example, there is a series of space games, uh, X the Final Frontier, X2, X3. Um, the second and third of those used pixel shaders, and since my system was unable to render them, it had a side effect of making space stations and asteroids and ships solid black, because the transparent now, I may be interpreting how it's working improperly. I just, I'm going based purely off the visuals and not the underlying problems. It made uh, all the objects appear black with uh, basically any light or something that was on an object, like the light on a uh, spaceship would still show up, and it led objects to being an odd black and white. Well, in the case of asteroids, it really helps if you can see where you're flying in space. I'm going to leave it at that. Lots of collisions. <laughs> but yeah, it was from my perspective, because the pixel shaders weren't rendering properly and were just solid color instead of a transparent or shaded texture. Another example would be uh, the Elder Scrolls. Oblivion did not react well if you took out pixel shaders. Uh, it made the world so bright and colorful. But, uh, yeah, it took some of the ambience away. Well, quite a bit of the ambience. It was playable, though. And roll. Ha ha. Something tells me this. Holy mackerel! Holy hell! Um, I, I mean, uh, good. Yeah. Uh, more monkeys for the incinerator. Shut up. <laughs> He doesn't want to admit he was uh, surprised. What do you mean his throat is gone? What bit him? Usually a creature doesn't lose their throat unless uh, typically predatory behavior. But yeah, put bluntly, Clarence is trying to hide the fact that he was either you know, that he was. It really is quite amazing. You monkeys and your problem solving. How do you manage it with such small, singular brains? Isn't it terribly quiet not hearing the thoughts of every one of your brothers? I, I don't know if he's uh, trying to, if he's embarrassed that he was caught off guard by that, or if he's starting to feel sympathy. Secondly, well, as a race, people value their individuality, so uh, yes, we like the quiet. Sharing one's headspace with, uh, you know, one or two other voices is enough to drive is enough to drive people crazy, without having to deal with the voices of hundreds or thousands, etc. Mattresses, pretending to be walls. Incoming video chat. You came. I guess I didn't really expect you to bother. My lab partner's such a pessimist. Was such a pessimist. It kind of rubbed off on me. He tried to make it through to me not too long ago. I guess he's a bit late for the party. You'll have to make a quick detour over the surface next, but be careful. If the cold doesn't kill you, well, let's just say I didn't pick the safest of locales for my last ditch survival attempt. Okay, good news. Um, good news. Good Oh, yeah. I think I've got a cure. Well, it's not really what you'd call a cure-cure, but it should be enough to help you. I don't think I'm right, infected. I was careful, but I guess if you come rescue me and I'm looking at you like you're a roast chicken, I got it wrong. Sorry. That probably wasn't funny, was it? No. I suppose not. Well, I hope to see you soon. Yeah, yeah, cures, rescue, saving the world, all so cliché, all so ridiculous. Do you really think you're doing the right thing? 
Your morality is just a lasting stain left behind by religion. File was corrupt. Well, I'm not surprised. Hey. <laughs> Bonk. A cure. I had my doubts by then, but I didn't have much choice. I resolved to find Amabel and put things right. Oh, well, we're back on the surface. <sighs> I'm not actually cold, you understand? I'm just trying to make you feel better. Very inefficient thing, your brain. Gives off lots of heat. If I had the lighter from the last game, I could light that barrel and uh, have a nice heat source. Randoka. Frozen. Not the movie. The, uh, the, the controls. Oh! The controls are frozen. Now, if I were you, which arguably I am, I'd be asking myself in a gormless sort of voice, did that bridge really collapse, or is my good friend Clarence just playing an hilarious jape? The answer, monkey man, is that I don't even know myself. One way to find out, please, don't get us killed. Oh, well, if you insist. Whee! That bridge really did break. Now, if I <laughs> were you, which arguably I am, I'd be asking myself in a gormless sort of voice, did that bridge really collapse, or is my good friend Clarence just playing an hilarious jape? The answer, monkey man, is that I don't even know myself. One way to find out, please, don't get us killed. Oh, but it would be so much fun. So what was the point in coming down here? <laughs> You're not actually telling me I have to build a bridge across here. You know what, I'm gonna go back into the, uh, the heat drill here. Good thing I can't jump on top of that, uh, I'd probably make bad decisions. I really pray you're joking. Yeah. Ha ha! I will survive! Falls off cliff five seconds later, but still singing. I'm as fit as can I burn the milk? We shall have cooked milk. Aha. That did not work. Miniature flamethrower. Let's hope it doesn't freeze up before it gets across. Haha. Generator is most likely. Hmm, this is red. He's plastered all over your mind like a garish wallpaper. He wanted to die and <laughs> we wouldn't let him. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's kind of humming up the place, if you know what I mean. Weird smell. Excuse me a minute. I'm gonna go give you a memory of him a good kicking. Don't touch my memories, you goon. Brag. <laughs> I'm just picking up everything. I don't want to burn it. It might come in handy later. Exactly. Case in point. Oh, that didn't work out as planned. You shivered at the wrong time. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, it jammed itself into position. The 
cloth won't ignite. Oh, alcohol. Oh, there went the uh, bottle of alcohol. <laughs> Is there anything this way? So help me if there's a bottle of painkillers out here in the snow, I'm gonna laugh. What's on the other side of this door? Well, we're at the 15 minute mark, so we're gonna have to find out next time. After the loading screen finishes. Okay, so, on the to-do list. Find this damsel in distress, kill the bad guys, cure infection, save the world. Chances of success? Nil. Chances of survival? Well, you've got old Clarence on board. That should speak for itself. Chances of you buggering things up royally? Almost certain. That's what I'm good at. Messing stuff up. And jumping downstairs. Well, that didn't do it goes planned. But, uh, I will see y'all next time.